Hello, it's King Zombies here playing some more Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Last episode, we rewokened Rock in order to clear this ether miasma. So let's do it. Miasma, schmiasma. The wind is my mate. Come, winds, lend me your transient fleeting aid. Wow. That hardly took any time at all. <laughs> I did say it was a simple task. Thanks a bunch, Rock. Rock? Tell me something. My previous driver. You mean Van Damme? Yes, this Van Damme. What kind of a man was he? He was incredibly strong. He looked kind of scary, but he was kind, too. And he saved my life. It's thanks to Van Damme that we're all standing here now. I see. Then I think I'd better protect you all, too. Huh? To carry on my driver's will as best I can. That's the path I feel best befits a blade. Oh, Rock. Okay. Uh, so where was it we had to meet up with some guys? Was it? Okay, it appears to be this direction. Over here somewhere in this cave, maybe? That looks right. So what's the plan? Looks like there's quite a few of them. And they have blades, too. No time for complicated plans. Don't worry. There'll be no match for us. I knew you'd say that. But hey, I'm not saying you're wrong. Just remember, we're not here to kill anyone, so mind you don't go overboard. Was Rex Rex not going to Avenge Village? There's more than one way to do that, right? Well, if you say so. Understood. Right. Let's go. All of you, put down your weapons. You're not gonna harm that city. Who the hell are you punks? We ain't got time for a bunch of kids. Hold it! They're drivers and blades! Now I get it. The city hired you, huh? What do you think? <laughs> How'd you find out about... Whatever. Hey, lads! Let's slaughter these brats! We'll make an example of them! Yeah! yeah! Okay. Time no, they're to not too tough. Down. I'm higher level than them. Yeah, let's all focus this guy. Benjamin the Brain. Sounds like the leader. I mean, he is the highest level of the three. He's also weak to fire. I should use that to my advantage. Come on. And it's starting to get off my blade attacks. There we go. Did you shoot lasers right past me? I don't even know if they did damage. I don't think so. This guy's not too tough. 
I don't even think I'm that much over leveled either. Pretty sure I'm basically where I need to be. Whoa. Yeah, this stuff. Got the rare core crystal. And after we take down this guy, the last one we'll hit with a chain attack. Three, three. Can't. Or chain type thing for blade chain. Let's grab this core crystal. And let's go. Me first. I guess I'll use Rock because he's kind of new. I haven't really used him in a chain attack, at least. Kind of showing off the different blades I have. Of course, Poppy because I have to have Poppy in this. And I don't get a second set because uh, uh, I didn't have a, a thing on him, an effect. He's close to being dead, too. Okay, and there we go. <sighs> well, we managed to beat them, all right. But what now? Ah, right on time. Oh, I get it. That's why you ask the kids to call them you. It isn't us they need to answer to. Right? Leaving them to the authorities. A wise decision. I suppose we should probably leave then. It's not a good idea to be here when the military arrives. Let's go. Yeah, let's move. So you see, considering the situation, could you let them off the hook? Hmm. I'd hate to deny a request from you, Rex. And I can see these kids have had a hard time. What do you think? Well, I suppose I did get my ship back safe and sound. Hey, how about this? Make them work for the guild, and get them to work off what they owe that way. What? These brats! Are you saying? We should make salvagers of them. I think they show a lot of promise. They've got pretty quick fingers. Right? Come on, you know it makes sense. They're poor little orphans with nowhere to go. Are you really just gonna turn them away? You sure know how to twist a guy's arm. All right, I'll do it. I'll sort out the details with Papoonin. But it's just bed and board for now. Got that? If you want paying, you prove yourselves first. You hear that? I hope you don't mind. Wow. Right then, work hard, you rascals! Ah, yes. And now we can get on the ship to Mora Dane. That was a big detour. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, we, we missed the ship. Tenth floor, was it? There's no tenth floor. <laughs> it's on the fourth floor. Shall we get going? 
Yeah, don't don't let them take any of my money. My hard earned money. We got back. Somehow. Ooh, I hope the mercs have well. come back. The beast core is now ready to use. Oh. Huh. Tempting. That was the wrong button. Oh, I keep doing that. Ugh. Can I give Barry a First, let's receive our stuff. With this power. Cool. From strength to strength. Cool. Oh wow. Oh no, I thought you, I thought you got get all those three things. Hmm. Where was the best ones? So this one has two, this one has two. Two for forty. Uh is currently the best. Uh two for forty. Three for fifty. I think that's that's much better. Four for an hour and forty. That's not as good as three for fifty. Okay, so I have three for fifty is currently the best. Three for forty, definitely the best so far. Okay, some sweet and healthy food are really popular with ladies of Argent in Argentum. I want to import some. Okay, so could you search out trade routes for me? Sure. Everyone's counting on me. I got okay, I need like three things I'm saying. And a fire? I only have one fire, don't I? No, I do have another one. I won't let or a couple, down. actually. I vow to carry out my sworn Reporting. duty. Your okay. We are Go for it. Ursula's new groove. And we'll do what we can. Cool. So we'll be back in 40 minutes. Possibly next episode. Uh, I think I do need to just bond the blade. We'll go with Nia this time, though. Just because. I really do want to see what this one is. Of course we want to view the Awakening. Let's go. <laughs> okay, I think it's amazing. Wow. That wasn't the same blade as before, right? <laughs> oh, it's totally not fitting for Nia. Oh. Oh, but he looks amazing. I think I am just gonna set him just because. Uh, yeah, we'll switch your other healer. Let me also favorite. It sounds fun. Didn't do that before. Oh my gosh! See, you equipped out for. Oh my gosh! Look at that guy. <laughs> He's twice as hot, tall as she is. A little less, but yeah. Sheesh. That's amazing. Woo. I think we should go head up, though. I mean, there are some quests in here, though. That would also be a good idea to do. It says there's one, like, right here. What? Oh, right back here. Do I want to do this right now? I think I'm gonna wait a little bit because I kind of want to see it what this new area is like. 
I know I'm delaying it a little bit by walking up these stairs, but that's fine. That's fine. Ah, oh, it's down here. Not up any more stairs. Can I get through this yet? Poppy power. Leave no. Not even close. That's fine. It'll take a while. Let's see if I can find this guy. Oh, he's down here. Hello, I know we're like uh, a week late. But I'm ready now. <laughs> it feels like a week. It's actually, for me, it's been like a month, but that's fine. We've made it. Oh. It's a pretty long voyage, was it now? It this does look like a very industrial place. Very different from previous areas we've been. More empty than Poppy expected. The small port separated from the main city. Which is probably good. Oh, but we want I guess we do want to go to the capital then. Never mind. It wasn't that good then. If we just head out of port to the right, it should be a straight path there. Hmm. Better keep our wits about us. Oh, Tiger Tiger has a new stage. I really needed to spend time and do that and upgrade Poppy. Interesting little thing. The treasure trail. Treasure acquired. Open up. Oh. Wow, fortitude. I don't have anyone with fortitude. Oh my gosh, that guy's huge. <laughs> Hi, Tim L. What do you have to say? Our new ship's leaving for Indole for a fair while. I guess that's where I need to go next, maybe. Go to the camp at all. Follow a straight path. Okay. There's a little quest to knock on here. I don't know if I want to accept any quests right now. I kind of want to do a little bit more story progress and then maybe next episode, depending on where the story leaves us, uh, head back and do try to finish up these other side quests. Oh my gosh. I am no longer over leveled. Come out, come or out. Even close to being over leveled. I am now under leveled. <laughs> oh boy. So yeah, I, mean, I could probably take them, but still, this is the capital. It's kind of hard to tell in all the smog. Hello. I guess it's close enough to the capital. Hello, what do you have to tell me? It's today's hot topic. Top of the elevator is Alba. Vonich, the Imperial Capital. Top quality core chips and accessories there. Yeah, I kind of want to go to there. Most food in the Empire is pretty awful, but there's something called Quotella. Quotelletta. Okay. Just don't have Kostya. Okay. I'll try to keep that in mind. Page engine when you're operating this thing. Everyone get in. How high up does this go? Well, maybe all the way to the cutscene. No, it shows it outside. Maybe not. 
Let's see. Oh. oh I hate it when elevators do that. Uh, but here we are in the capital. So this is the Imperial Capital. Such a big city! Maybe their place is selling rare junk parts for upgrading Poppy! Time to go look! Master Pawn, Poppy would rather use new parts if possible. Meh, meh! Is that you there, Tora? I've not seen Tora in long time. Remember me? Mui Mui? Huh? Why random old guy know Tora's name? Oh, Tora not remember me at all. It Mui Mui. I was assistant of Professor Su Su, your grampy pod. Dora, remember? Mui Mui should have said to start with. Mui Mui did say. Oh, right. Mui Mui not very interesting, so Tora forgot he exists. Tora? That's not very nice. No, no, I do not blame Tora. Tora was very young back then. Not surprising he forget. Besides, Master Pon was quite distracted just now, only thinking of how to upgrade Poppy. Why, could it be? This looked like artificial blade. Mui Mui right. Tora studied Grampy Pon and Dada Pon's blueprints carefully and finished construction. Meh, meh. How wonderful. If only Professor Su Su still here to see results of hard work. Mui Mui, you have any idea where Dada Pon went? That day when the lab was attacked, Mui Mui was out on errand. When I got back, Professor Susu's body was lying there. <sighs> but there was no sign of Professor Tatazo. I see. Even Mui Mui not know. Do not feel down, Master Pon. We will find Dada Pon someday. Though no evidence for this hypothesis. Anyway, Mui Mui apologized for interrupting your trip when you just arrived in city. Friend of Mui Mui ran an inn just up ahead. Place with famous hot springs. If you like, Mui Mui can try to get you discount. Mui Mui is best friend! <laughs> <laughs> 